Okay, so I'm doing my December favourites today, even though it's really, really late. Okay, so it's a good thing that I actually write all my favourites down for the month of December because I was going to be probably showing you what I like in January, otherwise I would have forgotten them. Okay, so my first favourite I am going to show you. I think I used to wear all the time and it's like an old classic for me and it's the Sarah Jessica Parker. This is what it looks like. Packaging is very like colourful and different patterns of that and I thought it was quite cool but not that you should buy a perfume for the packaging. I used to do that, totally wrong decision because you could get amazing packaging but disgusting scent so I'm so glad I don't do that now. But I just, um, it was a bonus that happened to be cool packaging as well and it smells quite florally, fru fruity kind of smell. It's just say that because you know how bad I am at describing scents. It has been my favourite for a while but I hadn't worn it for quite a long time because I hadn't got around to buying it again and then I got it for Christmas so I was really excited that I had it again because it was one of my favourite perfumes so yeah. Another favourite of mine which has actually came in a big pack of stuff that I got for Christmas. I don't know if you saw but there was like these huge boxes of Soap of Glory stuff which I absolutely was like crazy about and I can't believe I got it. And what was in it was this whipped clean and it's a shower butter luxurious cream wash kind of almost like a two-in-one you can use it as a shaving cream and a body wash so that's really awesome and i absolutely love the scent it's really nice i have the scent of this in the lotion so that was really awesome and it's just really smooth and it's actually good um it says on the back it would be good for using um, as kind of like a shaving cream and I've been using it as that as well and it actually is, it's quite nice and um, the scents of it are like almond, um, sheer butters, that kind of thing, nutty oils um, so that kind of dictates the scent of it and yeah I really loved it and you know how much I love soap and glory yeah. you know how much I love soap and glory products Another one of my favourites, I'll have to insert a picture of me wearing it my next few favourites are kind of going to be winter warm kind of favourites. Quite snuggly and cosy and keep you nice and warm for the winter. Next favourites are these gloves that I got from Primark and they're originally four quid and they were reduced down to two pound. I so thought that was really good and they're really cute. These little kitties. So here you go. Here's one of them. The option to either wear them as mittens like this <laughs> or you have the option to wear them kind of like if you button them down um, where I'm just like this, so they're kind of like fingerless, but you still got your thumbs all nice and warm. Um, the only problem with these is that you, I can't use them with my phone. Like it's very hard. I have to take them all off if I want to use my phone. But they're really cute and they're really warm and snuggly. And like especially when I'm outside and that, they keep my hands nice and warm. And so they're not all ice cold and numb when I go inside. So yeah, and they're just really cute. You could just you know hours of entertainment with these you know just like <laughs> make your own little plays and everything on the bus if you don't mind like people looking at you weirdly a favorite i'm going to show you which is also quite snuggly i'm gonna have to take off my feet just for you guys got this as a christmas present and they're my new slippers and they are really snuggly oh and they've got like this furry thing inside which makes it extra snuggly and warm so they're really nice and warm and brilliant for indoors because I will never walk in bare feet, especially in the winter because obviously it's freezing too. Um, but yeah, so they're always really nice to have on your feet instead of just playing normal socks and also they'll keep your feet warm because I have like a weird circulation problem where my feet are always ice cold. So yeah, they're brilliant for that. The other favourite that I'm going to show you is also a very snuggly kind of warm one. And it is my onesie, which is very surprising because I never thought a onesie would be in my favourites because I don't know, they're fun to like wear and they're quite, you know, funny because you've got all the different characters and that, but I wouldn't, they're not very practical and I don't know, I didn't always find them that warm because some of them are just made of like this like light cotton material, but this one's actually really snuggly and fleecy and I also got this as a Christmas present and they said it was from Peacocks, so and I really love the hood because it's all fluffy and the thing I think why it's become one of my favourites is because with not many other like onesies I've seen they've got this kind of like elastic stretch bit on the feet and for the wrist which I really like because I don't like having my feet kind of like tucked in with the onesie I feel like restricted and stuff and I like to be able to move around in it so um, yeah and it's really warm and cosy and yeah 
and I just love Animal as well, he's one of my favourite Muppet characters and I love like zebra print and that kind of stuff so it's really funky as well and it my next favourite, I can't actually show you like what it is, it's a film and it's The Shining and yeah I know probably most of you are thinking haven't you watched that, it's been out for absolutely ages I only just got around to watching it and I actually like thought it was so awesome, I loved like the whole like plot and yeah I just really enjoyed it, enjoyed it. and I'm also glad I watched it because now I can understand when you see those weird Facebook like posts and it's got that man through the door saying here's Johnny or it's just stuff like that so now I understand that so that's good <laughs> um, yeah and it was just a really good film so if you haven't seen it go and watch it if unless you really don't like kind of I don't know blood and stuff then I guess you might find it a bit too much I don't know but I thought it was a really good film and yeah, it's one of my favourites now, so, and it's a classic. Last favourite I'm going to show you is also a Christmas present I got and it's this. And it is a, and it's a type of notebook and I haven't written it yet so you're thinking how could it be one of your favourites but I just love the like, um, kind of handmade craft of it and just everything about it and how it looks really um, like, kind of old fashioned and like historic. Um, it's made out of real leather, a uh, string of leather, I guess you could call it. Um, and then this is the front, and then this is the back, and this is inside. Oh, I like to put this over the front, but even though it's not meant to be like that. But I really just love um, everything about it, really. Like, and. It's just got that smell of old fashionedness, you know. The <laughs> side is handmade paper, so yeah. And I just really love what, everything about it and the way it looks, so. Oh, and also the, one of um, my favourite books actually on this book is the um, stem of the book, is it? Or the spine? Spine. Yeah, is the spine of the book. And I'll just show you. So yeah, I just love this like crisscrossy kind of you know, all the kind of um, impletes into the leather and stuff and yeah, so that was the gift I got for Christmas and I really loved it and I thought it was really awesome. So that's all my favourites for the month of December, sorry it took so long to like show them and that, as I said in my last video, kind of a bit technical difficulties and that with my laptop at the moment, um, but thanks for watching, if you want to catch me on Instagram, the name is Pixie Vicious and see you later, okay thanks, bye!